standing downstairs in 2517 Stanford Hills Drive. In this home, the four bedrooms are upstairs. Got a split floor design, you can see. And down here is your living room, your dining area, and your kitchen. So you got a really large living room. You got this brick wall on the back wall. Swinging around, you see all the room for furniture. And then back here, you have a separate area. Currently, it's got a piano set up. You could have a number of, you know, a number of uses back here. Coming back around, you see the wood burning stove. This thing right here, you know, the owners tell me that they have uh, yet to turn their heater on during the winter. Uh, this this keeps your heating bills really low during the winter and just, um, you know, it's useful for power outages, anything like that, but it definitely keeps your heating bills low all winter. Notice the floor. And then you've got your dining area. Moving back around into some cabinets. See the raised bar top here? That's going to provide some extra eating options. It, it raises up on this side too uh, for seating. You know, you can have guests over or those quick meals when you don't really want to deal with the table. You got the bay window that adds some space and some light to the kitchen. And then you really get a feel for just how much countertop space you have and cabinet space you have in this kitchen. It's actually, it's just huge. Walking back, you've got the door that goes out to the side yard. has a walkway that leads around to the patio. You've got a half bath here behind this door. It's a nice feature to have down in your living area. And then here, leading back around to the living room again, if I swing around past the stove, you've got the doors to the laundry area and the area with the water heater, some additional storage. So that's the living area here at 2517 Stanford Hills Drive.